Greetings, YouTube, and welcome to episode 47 of the 4,000 question challenge. Alrighty. What is one thing you would like to have changed in your mother's life? That's what ifism, and I'm not going to play it. What is the nicest thing a brother or a sister ever did for you? I only got one. Nicest thing my sister ever did for me. I don't have an answer to that. I don't know. Um, what is the oldest family photograph that you have? The oldest? I've got photograph. I mean, like of me or like the family in general? Because I think I've, my mother's got a picture for her parents when they were the day they were married. So that one. And I don't know if we have any photos from the family history that are older than that. I'm not sure. I think that may be the oldest one. Um, what is the location of your family's, family's memorabilia? Well, I, I got some, and my mother's got some, and my father's got some. I don't know if my sister has any. She's not really into material items. Um, what was one of your mother's strongest characteristics? What was? It's kind of a past tense. Um, at one time, she was very determined. What is one of the ways your mother, grandmother, and, and grandmother were, are alike, or father and grandfather? My mother's mother and her, I don't think they're alike a whole lot. I really don't. There are some traits that my sister shares with her mother, my mother, um, which I will never mention. And my sister will never see this video. Um, and there are traits that my aunt, my father's sister shares with her mother um, but my father takes after his father and I take after my father in a long chain of dysfunctional men um, what would you really like to say to your brother or sister I'm not going there does your family have strong traditions that you still observe uh, strong traditions that I mean positive I'm assuming well, my grandfather, my grandmother, my father's mother, started a tradition of giving me a check every uh, every year for my birthday, the same number of years I was old. And my father has continued to do that, and on my last birthday, I got fifty-four dollars from my father as a gift. Um, how much time did your parents spend with you when you were a child? Well, my mother was a stay-at-home mother when I was a kid. And my father was always away. A lot of the time he was out chasing, so he'd be on the road. So we could go days without seeing him, which was a gift. Um, so it depends on how you want to look at that kind of thing, I guess. Um, did your parents choose legal guardian, a legal for you, if they die prematurely? If so, who? That's an excellent question. Seeing as my father's sister lives on the west coast, like the Pacific Northwest, maybe we would have ended up in with my aunt Georgia, the youngest, because she had three children, so maybe they would have put us there. That would have not been healthy for me. She was a, not a, a, a liberal person in any way, shape, or form, evangelical Christian. I would have not have done well there at all um, things would have ended poorly um, I guess so I don't know I never bothered to ask and at 54 it doesn't really matter but I'm assuming that we would have probably ended up with my my aunt Georgia that would probably would have been the been the most likely place to send us um, somewhere in I would have ended up living somewhere in Pennsylvania hope you've enjoyed this episode and I will see you in the next